Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In this lesson, you'll learn about the different account types that are available to you in Peachtree. Some of the different types of accounts that we'll cover are assets, liabilities, and equity. These are shown in the balance sheet within your company file. Now first off, we're going to look at asset accounts. Now your asset accounts are used to track both current assets, which are assets that you're likely to convert into cash within a year or use up within the year, and fixed assets, which are loans that you make to others of a long-term nature, equipment, buildings, property. We'll also look at liability accounts. And you use liability accounts to track both current liabilities, which are scheduled to be paid within a year, and long-term liabilities. These are loans that you have to pay back over more than a year. We'll also examine equity accounts. These are used to track owner's equity, including capital investment, draws, and retained earnings. Now Peachtree has two account types for tracking the value of your short-term and long-term assets. The other current assets account tracks assets that are likely to be converted into cash or used up within one year. Examples of other current assets might include amounts for treasury bills, certificates of deposit, prepaid expenses, which are amounts already paid for services your business has yet to receive, prepaid deposits, which will be returned to you at a later date, reimbursable expenses, and notes receivable if due within one year. Other examples of current assets are accounts receivable bank accounts, and cash. Peachtree provides three types of current asset accounts for you to use as you create the accounts for your company. There's the cash account, which tracks each bank account as well as petty cash, accounts receivable, which tracks money owed to your business, and other current assets, which tracks current assets that are going to be converted to cash or used up within a year, but are neither accounts receivable nor cash. We'll also look at fixed assets, and a fixed asset account tracks assets your business owns that are not likely to be converted into cash within a year. A fixed asset is usually something necessary for the operation of your business, like vehicles, computers, or office equipment. These will also tend to be assets that have a considerable value, which you use up over a period of several years in a process known as depreciation. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.